A country road in Belgium, winding peacefully through the hills of the Arden Forest. But from time to time, his peaceful life is ripped apart, and the road is now being got ready for different and exciting things. Right. We're going to go out onto the old, original spa. I've not seen that, you know. I, I think I might have seen some footage of it a long, long time ago. In the Mercedes camp, the air is charged with confidence. Fangio, Moss and Kling have a superb technical service to back them. And an aristocrat of a car. Did you put the heated seats on? Did you put that heated seat on? You just <laughs> Did you do that? <laughs> Hold your map. Interestingly, the lap was a double what the current Grand Prix track is, but yet it only had 21 corners. The current Grand Prix track is 21 as well. So as we stopped at the beginning of the old circuit, we've just come through Lacombe. Mm -hmm. This section of track, they would have been doing about 160 miles an hour yep. with no barriers. It's crazy. <laughs> I just can't imagine the speeds, you know, one average 160 mile an hour on this kind of track without no barriers or anything or seat belts is just nuts. And they were being paid in food stamps and in kind. <laughs> <laughs> Should we go and check out yeah, the rest of the track? Yeah, that was not my kind of time. <laughs> Your youngest fans here. Mm -hmm. I'd come and watch when you were racing at McLaren. I hunted out an old picture. <laughs> How old would you be there? Well, that was just when I just signed. Yeah, I was 13. I, uh, I could sense your speed then. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't. I mean, who the hell is this? Your head's actually shrunk. <laughs> Burnonville, two and a half miles on. Fangio has the lead still. Right, we've stopped here down at Burnonville, so we're getting into the heart of the, the old classic circuit. And we've got this image here, which I think we see Pescarolo and a Matra. We can see exactly the house that is still here today. That's crazy. <laughs> the old farm farm there. It doesn't even look like his name has changed. Here. Anyway, there's just no, you know, look, these people just standing here. Yeah. Shall we move on? on? Master. Master, always Fangio in front of Moss and Castellotto. Thanks for putting my seat on. <laughs> oh, is the seat on? Oh, is your bum hot? I'm roasting, man. I'm starting to sweat a little bit. <laughs> She's iron on fire. <laughs> so we have, where's the kink? That's a good question. This is not, there's not really much of a kink. This is a... Well, when you look back here, you consider they were going flat out. What speed do you think they were doing there? Uh, I think about 175 miles an hour. So this one looks like it's uh, the challenging one. Yeah, because then you've got the bridge as well. Hollowell Corner. The speed is fantastic. I'm but... nervous. And this is 2013. Yeah, but you're, you're getting old. That's why. Oh, <laughs> you keep telling me that. No, no. I'm trying to make myself feel younger, that's why. <laughs> Catching up with you. Oh, how old are you, 25, 26? Yeah, yeah, thanks, man. Are you? What are you? 28. Are you really? Yeah, man, I'm getting old, dude. You? Oh, man, that is old. 28 <laughs> years old. <laughs> We're now heading down to Stavlo. This is just flat out down here, man. Oh, so you can actually see the old track. So this is not a, a road now, this is also just a service road. Mm. So this has got quite a kink in it. Quite banked, huh? Can you imagine coming round here? And if it goes wrong, I know. We stopped at Stavlo. Mm -hmm. Beautiful sweeping banked corner that takes us all the way back down to what you know as the Grand Prix track. We can actually see some of what's left of the old Grand Prix track. Oh, yeah, look at that. In behind the tree, no a way. bit of Armco. It's uh, touching a bit of history there. I guess there was no barrier up here, it was just a brick wall, man. Yeah, that was probably considered. Very secure Safe. in those days. <laughs> At the beginning of the return ascent, Fangio is on his own in front. With 300 miles of superlative driving behind them, the Mercedes pair press on to victory. This is so cool. By the time you get here, it's just flat out, man. And Monsieur Bacon's checkered flag puts a seal on Fangio's win. Here we are, bus stop chicane. End of the lap. The crown of an unforgettable day and of a Belgian Grand Prix high in the tradition of the great Francorchon circuit. Keep your fingers crossed for me. Thanks for your time. Thanks for your time. Cheers. You keep saying I'm old. Can you not squeeze my hand so hard, no, you please? Used, you used to have a good handshake. What the hell happened? I got old. <laughs> <laughs>